AMISUM was created in 2007 by the African Union's Peace and Security Council. Its mandate was to support the fragile government in Mogadishu and secure the country from Al-Shabaab terror attacks. On the 21st of February 2007, the United Nations Security Council approved the mission's mandate. The mission is composed of approximately 20,000 soldiers, police and civilians tasked with supporting the government of Somalia. Now, AMISOM troops are drawn from Uganda, Burundi, Djibouti, Kenya, and Ethiopia, who are deployed in six sectors covering South and Central Somalia. Now, the African Union mission in Somalia recaptured Janale, a stronghold of Al Shabaab, on March 17, 2020. Janale, approximately 90 kilometers southwest of the capital Mogadishu, has been the hub for the terrorist operations and activities. In 2015, Ethiopian troops in the African Union peacekeeping mission and Somali soldiers captured Dinso district, about 120 kilometers southwest of uh, Baidoa. Located 125 kilometers from Belet Wayne in south central Somalia, Bulobudo, an Al Shabaab stronghold, and their supply nerve center was also recaptured by AMISOM troops. Now, AMISOM also secured the towns of Al Degli and Barire located southwest of Somali capital Mogadishu along the Shabele River. Now, in 2018, Al-Shabaab militants attacked an AU peacekeepers uh, base in the town of Bulamare, 130 kilometers southwest of the capital Mogadishu. In April 2016, six Ethiopian troops were killed in the Blasting Bay region. Now, in February 2016, attacks saw 15 Ethiopian troops dead in clashes in Lower Shabele. In January of the same year, scores of Kenyan troops were killed in an attack on a base in El Ade. In September 2015, over 20 were killed in a suicide attack on a base in Janale, including at least 12 Ugandan troops. Now, last year, a military offensive operation conducted by the African Union Mission in Somalia and the Somalia National Army in the Lower Shabele region resulted in a crushing defeat of Al Shabaab militants who lost control of the areas of Basra. Al-Shabaab still poses a huge threat inside Somalia and remains a menace to countries in the region, including Kenya and Uganda.